So what's happening this morning? Mm. The injector pump is coming off. I don't know why my light's on. The injector pump is coming off and we're going to show you some very, very interesting new mods. I've taken the injector pump off the sport line as you've seen this morning. Bit of dirty oil in it because it's obviously been running on my engine. Um, I don't normally like to put pumps that have dirty oil on my bench. So what we're doing today is we're going to fit the new Alder system that I've designed um, and also the new anti-jerk system to show how it works, why it works and what it does. Um, this is the new slider for the uh, for the boost and we've got written on it the, the high and low fuel so that it's easier for me to explain to customers uh, what to adjust over the phone. The, uh, the new back plates which obviously are going to go in there. Now you'll notice this one that's engraved on the top, Superfloid 8.5 170. Um, these are 8.5 mil superfluid elements. Um, this pump is on my own personal uh, sport line. Today I'm going to set it up and then we're going to see what it looks like on the pump. Okay. Diesel Pump UK anti jerk system. Um, it has a very functional purpose uh, and that is to turn the original rack housing into a damper. It does this by injecting oil through a drilled capillary. Now when these come, if you don't want the anti-jerk system, you don't have to have it. It's not drilled all the way through. That pilot is nearly all the way through and if you want to use it, if you want to use the system, you just pop it through with a drill bit and you can also do it different sizes to suit the severity of your issue. Now obviously we don't want to be pumping loads of oil in here, filling it up and causing all sorts of problems. Um, because that would be insensible. All we want to do is give uh, a sort of a, a pull, like a pull along the bottom, because um, it has quite a large drain hole there, you can just see. Um, so the oil can get away, that's not an issue, but what we're wanting to do is create a bit of a puddle um, that kind of just slows that rack down so it doesn't have the ability to uh, 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 jump and jerk, which causes that horrible bonanza effect which is well known in the super turbo diesel world and it is a big big problem. Now the other thing that this plate provides is rigidity to the side of the pump, it's very thick, it's much thicker than the original, even the aluminium version and it stops the distortion that can happen when you tighten the bolts into the side plate. So it's again quite common to find that a lot of these uh, custom injector pumps you get, um, doesn't matter on who built it or whatever but get one, if you have one that particularly jerks a lot on either, so it's ooh, 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 you tend to find if you slacken off the actual bolts in the side, it stops it. Um, and it's simply because the actual aluminium in the side just gets very slightly distorted when those screws are tightened. And that causes that jerking effect, which is really quite annoying. With this really thick side plate, um, again, we have a cure. Nice and thick, perfect. Now, there is another great uh, aspect to this. This side plate also fits on the EDC pumps. Now, there is talk of the EDC pump uh, needing an anti-jerk system because that's jerking really bad too. Surprise, surprise. So this will fit onto that as well. Haven't tested it on that yet, so it's a little experimental, but I don't see why it shouldn't work any different to this. And also, there was talk of uh, potentially fitting a slightly stronger uh, spring in the rack of the EDC pumps, but apparently that may get the, um, the governor warm, the, the electronic solenoid in the governor, apparently get it too warm. Well, with the extra oil that this is going to inject, hopefully that will help it to cool as well. So th there's lots of strings to its bow. Okay, party people, <clears throat> here we have the injection pump of your dreams. <laughs> okay, so uh, a few bit, little bits and pieces that we've designed. Anti-jerk plate on the side there, which um, is all billet aluminium. 
hydraulic uh, line insert, takes a feed from your oil uh, pressure, just um, from your uh, oil filter housing which is mounted behind. O-ringed uh, lift pump gasket uh, replacement cover. Obviously this doesn't use the paper gasket anymore that leaks and it's a nice thick plate which doesn't warp. Now this, this is the new boost slider um, which is quite quite a, a leap from the classic version. Um, we've got three support beams so that it's a hell of a lot like less likely to get damaged or bent. Um, we've also got um, the option to flip this over the other way around. And if we flip it over, then the, uh, the, the point at which the stop touches the lever becomes lower. And then as the boost actuates it, it actually actuates it slower. So you get a, a slower rising rate of fuel. Back plate, uh, 10 mil billet aluminium. Um, again, totally reduces or uh, basically eradicates the, the chance of the original one leaking. And obviously a plate to denote what power the, uh, the pump is gonna be. And there's a few different versions of that. Uh, we also do them in different colors. Um, and this dark gray, which is very nice. And uh, yeah, so we're gonna put that all on the sport line because it looks amazing. It's like Christmas. It's like Christmas for the sport line. And then we're gonna test out the anti-jerk system to make sure it's working perfectly. And then you, the customers at home, can have one in your stockings for Christmas. So long. Bless this car with power and no jerking. One, one sexy little pump movement. It feels much easier to install with this style Alder system as well. Oh, look at that, it slid so right in. I literally oh. just fired it straight in. That looks good. That no, looks awesome. Can't wait to pipe that bad boy up and. <laughs> Just while I'm putting this back together, standard return banjo and it's been drilled out. Uh, no special return system on this one. Uh, old school, uh, just banjo fitting uh, filter housing. Um, Bosch 44 at the tank pushes through a hard line into this, pressurizes this, then goes into the pump. This is where the sensor reads. It's just basically a boss that's welded onto the end. Sensor reads the fuel pressure, and then that that uh, just pressure banjo restricts the return, and we get our pressure in here. And then you get a pressure reading. Oh, um, it's just an oil pressure gauge that I put in the centre console. Works absolutely fine. Um, cheap, easy, and brilliant. Effective. No rising rate bollocks where a pipe can fall off and then your system goes totally tits up. That just works every time you switch it on. It's fine. On the dyno, testing out the new Alder system with the anti-jerk system uh, on the pump that I showed earlier. And basically, so that everything worked properly um, because obviously it uses hydraulic force. Uh, we need to make sure it makes similar power to what it did before and that the oil that's actually damping the rack isn't holding it back, which it should be if the calculations are all right. But the dyno is the show by way to test. So here we go, we're going to get another quick run. Obviously the pump's capable of big, big horsepower, but we're only running the budget kit. So let's do it.
the anti-jerk system worked. This is a product that this market has needed for since the start of time. Even the original pumps can jerk. So to have conquered this quest, this this hurdle is just absolutely amazing for me. It's one of the main reasons I sold this car in the first place seven years ago because I hated it because it jerked. And now, literally, any gear, very gentle acceleration, and I'm getting nothing, even if I'm half throttle, nothing at all. No jerking whatsoever. Um, and before mid throttle, part throttle, I was uh, 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 uh. now nothing, absolutely nothing. So there you go, the whole bonanza and jerking effect mystery and quandary. If you have it, buy my anti jerk system, it works. I love it, I'm happy, I'm going home. Thanks, bye.